hello guys thank you for coming to this channel remember to subscribe and give a like to this video you are watching okay so in this video we are going to answer this question under the laboratory preparation of ammonia okay so this question is adapted from uh, a 2018 past paper science past paper okay paper two question okay so uh, the statement above reads the diagram below illustrates the laboratory preparation of ammonia. The diagram below illustrates the laboratory preparation of ammonia. Okay. So I will begin by uh, giving you this important note. Okay. So this note goes to say, to make ammonia, you heat any ammonium uh, compound with a strong alkali. To make ammonia, you heat any ammonium compound with a strong alkali. Okay, let's proceed. So, uh, in the round-bottomed flask, we have ammonium chloride and calcium hydroxide. Ammonium chloride and calcium hydroxide. Okay, so uh, the, uh, this, uh, this what is in the round-bottomed flask is being heated okay you can see heat is being applied okay and we have structure x and above there the ammonia which we are preparing okay so the first question goes to say construct a balanced chemical equation for the reaction being illustrated in the diagram above construct a balanced chemical equation for the reaction being illustrated in the diagram above okay so where are we going to to get the uh, uh the reaction or the equation the chemical equation okay so we are going to obtain our equation uh in the round bottomed flask okay so ammonia was uh, ammonium chloride was reacted with calcium hydroxide okay so that's where we are going to get our chemical equation okay so when you react ammonium chloride uh, with calcium hydroxide, we are going to produce calcium chloride, water, and the gas we are preparing, which is ammonia. Okay, so this is a balanced chemical equation. Okay. Question B, B1. State the common name of substance X. State the common name of substance X. What is substance X? Okay, so the common name of substance X is calcium oxide. Okay, calcium oxide. So you put calcium oxide. So this calcium oxide is also uh, known as quick lime. Okay, question B2. What is the purpose of substance X? What is the purpose of substance X? Okay, so substance X acts as a drying agent. Okay, so substance X is used to dry the ammonia. Okay, question C. Why is ammonia collected by using the method shown above and not above water? Why is ammonia collected by using the method shown above and not above water? Okay, so it is because the gas is lighter than air or ammonia is lighter than air. Okay, so this is why ammonia is collected using this method. Okay, so under the preparation of gases in the lab, you need to know how these gas jars are placed. Okay, so when it is facing... Uh, down it is facing down then the gas being prepared is lighter than air okay when it is just standing uh, normal upright uh, then the gas is heavier than air okay so you need to know how these gas jars are placed okay so question d describe the chemical test for ammonia gas describe the chemical test for ammonia gas okay so for us to know that this is ammonia gas how can we test it okay 
So you uh, introduce a damp red litmus paper into the jar containing the gas. If the damp red litmus paper turns blue, the gas is ammonia, okay? So you introduce a damp red litmus paper into the jar containing uh, what you, are, you think is ammonia, okay? So if the damp red litmus paper turns blue, the gas is ammonia, okay? Question E, state two uses of ammonia. State two uses of ammonia, okay? So uh, ammonia is used to make explosives. Ammonia is used to make uh, nitric acid. Ammonia is used to make chemical fertilizers. So you just put two, okay? Thank you for coming to this channel. Remember to subscribe and share this video, okay?